Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil 7. Last time when we left off, we were ready to use the clown key to enter the shield in pursuit of Lucas in the second half, although it's really less than half, of Not a Hero. <clears throat> this is the morning immediately after the last time you saw me. Chris, we're showing a room located behind the shield machine. Lucas? It's possible. See if you can get in there to check it out. Got it. And yes, I'm pretty well hungover as fuck after the party I talked about last night, but it's all good. Now let's use the clown key to open up the shield machine. Excuse me. <coughs> uh, all right. No going back now. So obviously, before you come in here, just make sure you've picked up everything from out there. Yes, it just loaded us the hell up with ammunition, and it did that for exactly the reasons you thought it did. We're about to have one hell of a fight. Christopher, stay with us, I see. Very impressive, my friend. Very impressive. Let's just see how impressive you really are. Forget you need ramrods for the white ones. Hmm. Maybe you're good. Maybe you got lucky. What do you say? So many. You're slowing down, Christopher. Almost had you that time. Just how much more of this do you think you can take? These two are ordinary fat molded, like like the ones in the main game.
Say, I have really got to get out of there. Sympathy for me, asshole. I know, I know. I've done, I've done terrible things, horrible things. Oh. I killed your man. I tortured them, and I enjoyed every second, soldier boy. Just like I'm going to enjoy watching you burn. Commencing oh. countdown to detonation. Oh. Hear that? Sounds like time's running out for you. Tick tock, Christopher. Oh. This is a great it. Kill me, just kill me. For the love of God, shut the fuck up. Oh, I wish I could stay and watch you burn to death. But I can't. I have a nail So you pry up. You pry up that grate and you're able to get out of there. And that's that, and we have now found our way, finally, as in every Resident Evil game, eventually, <coughs> to a research facility. Chris, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. <coughs> we managed to intercept an email Lucas just sent out. Listen to this. Umbrella and Redfield have been taken care of. Dealing with them cost me some time. Cost them a lot more. But I can still get that data to you, but we're quits after that. He thinks I'm dead. This might be our chance. Who'd he send it to? We're still decrypting that. Just get Lucas. Keep me posted. There's a turret here, but it's not armed right now. And note the box that requires a lockpick. We'll be back for that shortly. Here is the research facility. So if we head up here, we find a door locked from the other side. Twelve minutes after dose, cell calcification. Five minutes after dose of vomiting. So these are the images and documents that we saw in the mine lab when we went through with Ethan. Oh, bloody, bloody handprints on the wall, always nice. You can see a couple of the white molded in there. They give us a couple of ramrods. We know what to do with these, don't we? We're in what's called the monitoring room. Let's look around before we head in there and deal with those guys. <coughs> 
WM002. All right. Oh, look here. Those are the little face hugger things. WM001A. And there's a fat one, WM001. Presumably, I'm gonna guess WM stands for white molded. Let's deal with these. some of Evelyn's paraphernalia in here, the wheelchair and the two dolls. There's that old photo of Mia and Evelyn. Our reward for coming in here is a med injector and two ramrods. Now I could have sworn there was a document in here, too. Yeah, there it is. E001 log, July 22nd, 2016. Health, good. Mental state, good. Mutamycete secretion, normal. Other, N.A. Not much change. She just plays with dolls all day. Turned two guys molded today. E001 log, August 12, 2016. So, about three weeks later. Health, coughing, exhaustion. Mental state, slightly stressed. Mutamycete secretion, more than usual. Other, N.A. After playing ball with Dad, she started complaining about being tired. Turned one guy into a fat molded. And two weeks later. E001 log, August 26, 2016. Health bad, mental state stressed, mutamycete secretion high, other sudden aging. She's aging all of a sudden, losing weight, hair falling out of the works. The more she screams, the more she vomits. Basement's heavily contaminated. No apparent cause for the aging. Gonna ask for further instructions. <coughs> E001 log, September 9th, 2016. Health weak but stable. Mental state, delusional, incoherent. Munomycete secretion, stable. Other, N.A. Aging has slowed, seems pretty stable. Got the E-necrotoxin from the company. Orders her to use it if she gets out of control. And I thought I was the funny one. Four documents and one lockpick left to find, and that's it, as far as collectibles. This guy is alive, Just in case you had any doubt. Every one of those was meant to be a punch. Oh well. Two more grenades, always good. And... We got a document. June 11, 2017. I'm sick of this guy, Lucas. They just gave him my job as lead researcher. Who do they think I am? Why do I, a Stanford graduate with a master's in microbiology, have to work under this lunatic? All he does is mess around with the test subjects, making them all fight each other and doing unnecessary autopsies. He's sick. He knows nothing about the E-series mutamycetes potential. I'm going to report his behavior at the next meeting with HQ.
there's no power. Lucas. Look around this room. I killed off all the connections researchers. They were poking around where they weren't supposed to when I wasn't looking, but I knew exactly what they were up to. Probably didn't like having to report to me. So I threw them in a cage with some molded. They shit their pants and begged for their lives. I'm just worried I won't be able to hold back from laughing when I make the report that they met with an unfortunate accident. Probably a good time now to cut ties with the connections. I'm the only one who can really make good use of Evelyn's mold. Fun, fun diary with a clown face on it. So we can get back out that way now. Got handgun ammo. Fire for e data. Got one. Set up. Get set up for transmission. Oh. There. By the way, is that second lock pick? So we can jog down here and open up that box we passed. Ah, it's armed, but apparently it has no ammo. There are two extra ramrods in there, which I'm going to go ahead and arm. Look at the computer. Sent. Thursday, July 20th, 2017, 10.22 a.m. Things got a little out of hand, but I took care of it. I'm sending the e-data now. It shouldn't take too long. After it goes through, I'm out of here. Presumably, that's when he saw us. There we go. That's all the documents. Nine of them. So let's save. Follow Lucas. Take those grenades, too. Another turret with no ammo. How the hell are you still alive? You should be dead. We got your emails. We know you're funneling info to someone. That's none of your goddamn business, Chris. A lot of people out there want to know about our little AV. A lot of people. Your friends, the connections, know about this? They don't strike me as the forgiving type. That's my business. You let me worry about that. You're about to have your hands full. You want to get? I, I, I don't. No. I don't believe it. Believe it. It's over. No. No way. Just shut up and accept it, Lucas. Oh. Love that one, Chippy. Ruh -ro. Oh boy. Oh, this is what it feels like. Got a situation down here. Infection is at critical mass. 
tell me something I don't know. Oh, I've got something for you! You're a fucking squirrel! You're going to need to proceed with caution. Extreme caution. Oh, well, that's different. Like it haven't been since we got here. Get that last item. So you get to refill your air tank one time. Time, but he should almost be dead. End of DLC. Game over.
Trunia River. What's the sit rep? The facility is clear. Even the newer breeds have been neutralized. Uh, and I'm out of here. Good. Think we did any good here? Not for them, unfortunately. But the mold is contained. Hopefully, they're Evie's last victims. <sighs> Hopefully. Chris, there's a call for you. You need to take it back at the camp. All right. I'm on my way. And that's it for the Not a Hero DLC. Achievement unlocked, mission accomplished. So we actually missed one antique coin, go figure. It wasn't on the list. <laughs> but you only need eight to get all the items. Still, I'm kind of curious where that tenth one is. We did get all the files, and that's about everything we need. All right, we have unlocked the professional difficulty, Thor's Hammer Site B. And, all right, that's everything. And that's it for this episode of Let's Play Resident Evil 7. Not the last one forever, but it'll probably be a while before I do another one. Until then, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed my videos, please consider clicking like, share, or subscribe. Any or all of which will really help me out. Regardless, please know that I appreciate you taking the time to watch, and I hope you have a fantastic day. Bye-bye.